percent of children who attend MSU's TK Martin Center have been on edge. That's because of social media speculation and changes to staffing. Today, Mississippi State announced a new director for the center. Our Riley Livingston joins us in the studio with more. No funding, no staff, fewer programs. Those are just some of the rumors surrounding the center that works with children who have special needs. And even though MSU addressed the concerns in May, today's announcement may be just what they need to put people's minds at ease. It's the start of something new for Mississippi State's T.K. Martin Center. Well, the future is positive. Assistant Professor Casey Stratton Gadke takes over next month as director. No stranger to people with special needs, she works with the university's Autism and Developmental Disabilities Clinic. But it's the fate of some of T.K. Martin's programs that worries parents. Some instructors are retiring, others are moving to part time. And parents say they are concerned that critical therapies and needed programs like Camp Jabberjaw, Project Impact, and Express Yourself Art have reached the end of the line. Stratton Gadke says not to worry. All of the great services and program it has in place will continue to remain in place under my leadership. We're very excited about that. I know many families and children and individuals in the community are very worried about that and whether or not their, their kids will have somewhere to come. And they will. We don't plan to have any of those services move away and I hope that we'll be able to add new services as we move forward. That takes money. As we move forward, funding is always a priority and that's certainly going to be a top priority for me. I'm really excited that with what funding the center has at the moment, I have some great relationships with those partners already. She will also look at staffing. As we move forward, I, I hope that we would be able to maintain staff that we have and be able to keep expanding the center. Stratton Gagge will take over as director on July 1st.